made it to Okinawa. So we dropped off our luggage. I got rid of my jacket too because it's actually pretty hot here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not hot, but it's warm. Yeah. It's no need for jacket. Not cold anymore. I was actually starting to sweat, so I guess for me it was hot. Mm. But now we're gonna explore Naha, well, more specifically, Kosukai Dori, which is a famous street here with a lot of souvenir shops and restaurants and drinks. I need food. As I usual. need both. currently walking through what they call in Japan the arcade which is like the indoor or I guess like in roofed mall area mm -hmm. shopping area not really a mall yeah. a lot of local vendors with really cute knickknacks souvenirs and clothes <laughs> some very interesting clothes we've seen <laughs> yeah I'm noticing they have their version of like Hawaiian shirts but it's like I guess more on the Okinawa pattern side um, but yeah it's cool it's very chill make it early what do you think of this right here Oh, it's burger. I don't want burger though. Amazing. So I guess Okinawa likes spam. <laughs> we got this spam onigiri basically. Well, it's open onigiri. It's called musubi. I don't know that, but it's freaking delicious. We got some blue seal, which I guess is a very famous it's ice Okinawa cream. Okinawa flavor too. We sea got, salt cookies. All right, so we got Okinawa sea salt cookies. It's good. Better than Hokkaido ice cream. I like this more than Hokkaido ice cream. Mm -hmm. Really good. So one of the things Okinawa is famous for is habushu, which is a liqueur that has a snake inside of it, specifically a snake called the habu snake, which is a type of viper and apparently related to the rattlesnake. So yes, it is venomous, but I guess it's dead and like sitting in the liquor. So at that point, it's no longer venomous. I, I don't know, but it was very expensive, like $500 and supposedly it helps with fertility, but uh, I don't know if I really trust that. <laughs> Another thing you'll see a lot in Okinawa is the Shisa, which are a mythological creature that is sort of similar to the guardian lions from Chinese mythology, but I guess Okinawa is slightly different. They're usually in a pair too, so you'll see two of them together. But yeah, they're cute. They're all over the place and they're like all different types. Like I saw one with a guitar. It's pretty cute. So what have we learned about Okinawa? You need a car. Yeah, rent a car if you come here. Like, there's, no, there's no trains out here. There's buses, but we've been riding buses for like four hours today. Or I guess by the end of the day, we will have ridden like four hours. So right now we're waiting for the final bus where we're going to be staying tonight in the very north of Okinawa. And tomorrow, well, you'll have to wait and see. I will set it. Good morning Good morning. from the north of Okinawa where today we are going to the Churaimu Aquarium. Probably said the name wrong but <laughs> as you can probably tell from the intros, uh, it's a little gloomy today. Not as sunny as it was yesterday but it feels fresh. It feels a lot like Puerto Rico actually. Yeah, it, it's very tropical. Last night we didn't get, didn't get to see it but it is tropical. You were saying it feels like in Salvador too, right? Mm -hmm. like you the go to mountains. the northern mountains? Yeah. Alright, so 
we took a little walk through the park to get to the aquarium. As we see here, there's a statue of a whale shark. And this aquarium is very famous because there is actually one here, or I don't know if there's more than one, but I'm excited because whale sharks are big. So for them to have one here, you need a lot of water and a big tank. Is this one of the biggest aquariums in Japan? I, I believe so. this is the biggest aquarium is in Osaka. Mm. But this is but people say this is the more this one's more nice. We'll see. Do you think there will actually be a whale shark? Oh yeah, there's there's a whale shark here. Oh my god. I think you have to explain your obsession with aquariums. I love aquariums. Ever since I was a kid, I don't know. I, I can't swim, but I love just aquariums. There's just something about fishes and it's so peaceful and relaxing and like, I don't know. There's a lot to look at. Like, look at them. Look at them. Look at these little things. He's my new friend. No thoughts. I'm really happy. It's so cool. Look at look at this little fish right here. He's just vibing. One of my favorite sea animals are probably jellyfish. They're so like there's something like mystical about them. I don't know. I can like stare at them for hours. Besides jellyfish, my next favorite is probably these garden snakes. And they're called garden sea snakes. Garden eels. Look at they're so cute and they're long and they're just they're just I call them vibing. I call them long boys. They're long boys to me. Look, he's slowly coming out. So we got a small glimpse of the whale shark, but I just have no words to be honest. Like the little glimpse we saw, I was like, oh, it's huge. It's so huge. But we're chilling with the regular sharks now. <coughs> just 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 vibing. And yeah, hopefully we'll get a better shot later of the of the big one. So we're enjoying our food. Yasha had to pay 500 yen to sit right by the, the fish, but look at them, they're literally right there close to us. So I've been wanting to come here for a very long time. So this was a very big bucket list item for me. So, it's a cool aquarium though. It, it is a mission to get here if you don't have a car. Um, but if you really, really like aquariums, then I recommend it. It smells so nice out here. It's fresh. It's also raining. It's so raining. We might be stuck here for a little bit. We have no umbrella. <laughs> I mean, we have like an hour until our bus back anyway. So, I really like the aquarium. It was a little smaller than I expected, but I guess to me, size doesn't matter. Well, with the aquarium. <laughs> <laughs> it's more about the quality and I feel like every exhibit there was very cohesive I guess like the, the types of fish they would put together with each other uh, just I don't know, they looked really pretty so uh, I like it and I've never seen a whale shark before the thing was freaking huge the other biggest shark I'd seen or whale was the belugas back in Chicago mm, remember yeah. that one Those are cool. anyway we'll figure it out we'll, we'll see what we're doing So ends our Okinawa adventure. That was long. Yeah. This is probably, yeah, it was the most difficult trip. 
to do. <laughs> now we head back to Tokyo. We have one more week in Japan. Crazy. <laughs> I cannot believe it's coming to an end, but it's been fun. Thank you guys for joining us. We'll catch you in the next one. <laughs>